one day we, we played um, Chicago and Robert Plant was there and he said, uh, let me push it out. So we're like, whoa. So me and Sav were sharing this laundry camp. We're like all crunched up and, and Robert Plant is pushing us out there with this bandana wrapped around his head and no one even noticed. So, you know, it's, that's how we would get to the stage. Obviously we didn't always use Robert Plant. Yeah, we've, I mean, constantly as Spinal Tap moments. Um, at one point, we had this, um, these giant, these triangles, you know, the, the album sleeves are triangle, and they were on stage, and it looked like Spinal Tap, and we hadn't seen them, but it was like totally embarrassed. So I think the same venue, I went running to the microphone, and a giant, it looked like a praying mantis was on my mic stand, and I was like, just freaked. I went to sing and there's this thing and it was like a monster. So I think that was the same venue where, where we had the kind of Stonehenge spinal tap kind of things going. So yeah, so yeah, things go wrong all the time. Big challenges doing the in the round thing. Um, uh, the whole idea came about Peter Mench, uh, uh, then manager, saw Frank Sinatra in, at, at the garden in New York and was like, dude, we got to play in the round. I just saw Frank and it was killer. We, we got to do it and so exhausting, but just total fun. You know, it's like not a bad seat in, in the house. You know, four front rows, basically. And like I said, I'd, I'd sing a vocal to sing down there, one on the side, one that side, one over there. So it's four, so it's eight all together. And, and you'd be like stuck on a mic, it was great. We did start running into each other initially and then you, you get proficient at it and then you kind of avoid the, the clangers so yeah.